how to promote YouTube videos on Google Ads. Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in this video, I'm going to be telling you how you can promote your videos on Google Ads. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. So first things first, as you can see, you are going to come over here onto Google Ads, ads.google.com. That is the website. And what you're going to do over here is just simply sign up or log in. It depends on you. Now, since this is a Google website, you don't have to worry about that. The sign up process is very simple. You can just sign in with your Google account and you are good to go. So let's go ahead and click on start now. And it's loading over here. So give it a couple of minutes for it to finish up. And then you just simply create your first campaign in a few simple steps. All right. You add in your business information, you create an ad and you set your budget. All right. You can skip the campaign creation if you want to. It depends on you as well. You can also create an account without, you know, a campaign. It depends on you. So this is optional. You don't have to actually add in your business information. As, as you can see, it is optional. So you don't have to worry about that. Uh, next, what you can do is maybe you can link some of your accounts. All right. That is a good step as well. But you can also skip that. But then you have your create your campaign over here. This is the main step where you are actually going to create your campaign over here is where you are going to promote your video over here you are going to select a goal for your campaign which is going to be page views brand awareness and if you click on see more you can have more options as well and we are going to be selecting brand awareness over here as you can see uh, reach a broad audience get views and build considerations for your brand so we're going to be selecting this and now we are going to scroll down and click on next and of course, this is the performance max campaign. So we are going to change the campaign time because we don't want any conversions. We just want brand awareness or reach. So we're going to change the campaign types over here. As you can see, this is video. This is the recommended one, you know, reach video viewers on YouTube and get conversions. This one looks good. We are going to select that video views over here. As you can see, you can also have a display as well. It depends on you, but we're going to select videos and we're going to click on next. Now, all you have to do is just add in your campaign details. So campaign name, as you can see right here, bid strategy, budget and dates, uh, locations, and all these demographics, all these different type of information that you're going to add, and then you are good to go. So over here, you can name your campaign, whatever you want. You can change your bid strategy to whatever you want, but currently we cannot because it is set to maximum CPV. So we're going to leave it at that. And then you have to enter in a budget type and amount. So over here, you can go ahead and select either a daily budget or a campaign total. It depends on you. And if you go for a daily one, then make sure that your budget is set to a good amount. And of course, you have to do research in order to find your budget although if you are starting out make sure your budget is low as possible all right depending upon your entire monthly budget so that then you can go ahead and divide it into a daily budget and then you are good to go and then you can work it out later you can go ahead and see if you are getting traffic if you're not maybe increase the budget if you are getting a good amount of healthy traffic maybe try to decrease it and see if you still get it find the sweet spot and you should be good to go and right now as you can see over here on the right hand side our impressions are 2 billion plus so as soon as we go ahead and add different types of uh, specifications within our ad this will decrease we want to get it as narrow as possible also i just want to say that if you go ahead and make your ad to a specific demographic or make it shown in specific areas meaning as narrow as possible then of course it's going to cost more so if i just select uh enter a location let's say we want to you know have our ad shown in brighton right brighton in england then over here our impressions are going to be 18 million so as you can see if we drop from a b to an m and let's say we want to also add london or east london can we add east london we'll just select london all right so these are the two cities that we want to target as you can see right here in questions and next what we can do is we can also add languages as well so we want to add just english language because that is the most common language right now and we want to add the ad group now we can also add related videos if you want you can add additional settings you mean you can add devices as well so over here you can select 
specific devices so either computer mobile tablet tv screens independent you i don't want to go ahead and select tv screens but i think computers and mobile are good so we're going to select that and we're going to select operating system so if you have a specific application that it only works on ios then you can go ahead and select that and we click on done let's say device model you want to have windows phones ios phones let's go ahead and select apple there we go want to select apple as well and network as well so united kingdom you can go ahead and select those if you want to but yeah for now we're gonna go ahead and select that now over here our weekly estimate is not available because i think we might have uh, broken it but yeah let's go ahead and remove this actually this was just to show you guys there we go we're back you can also add frequencies add schedule third-party payments and then you have your group over here you are basically going to add people your demographic who you want to reach all right age gender uh, parental status household income you can add all of these settings and basically you are promoting your video as an ad that is how you are going to get your video views so in demographic you can go ahead and select specific age groups if you want it depends on you but uh, and you can also add specific keywords that are related to your video or topic or add whatever you want to promote and you can also add placement as well so over here select the placement you can select youtube channel or youtube videos video lineups websites as well it depends on you so let's say we want to select youtube channels over here you can select youtube channels but over here requires a search so you got to search a keyword all right so let's say we want to search for let's say we search for finance all right and over here all these different channels are going to pop up so we can just simply go ahead and select these channels and our ad will mostly be shown on these channels videos and our ad will mostly be shown on these channels videos before you know people play it so you can, are good to go you can also add your youtube video right here so you can just simply create one in a few steps and you can upload one over here if you want over here create your video ad all right and of course if you already have created a video and it's uploaded all you would have to do is just paste the link right here so all right so this is one of my videos that i uploaded way way back so i'm just simply gonna go ahead and copy it all right i'm gonna copy the link and i'm just simply gonna paste it right here right this is the video that i want to promote all right so over here you select the video ad format you want to add like a skippable in stream ad or in feed video all right it depends on you you can go ahead and add that like this you can promote your video like this within the feed like you open up your youtube and you're going to see it right here as an ad or you want to place it as a skippable ad beginning of the video so it depends on you how you feel like it you can go ahead and do it you can add a final url as well you display url you can add a call to action if you want to have one it depends on you and then you just simply bid over here you add in your cost per video or cost per view bid and then you just simply create a campaign and then you are good to go after that you just simply add in your payment methods your credit card information so that you can finance your ad and you are good to go so that is it for this video guys hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications and if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that thank you guys for watching and until next time take care and goodbye